What's good? Welcome back to my channel. All right, today I'm going to be telling you the raw attractive power all men have that women won't admit to feeling. Now, one of my subscribers sent me this video of a woman basically telling men this power that we have that a lot of us don't know about and a lot of women know that we have it. And even when you're not an alpha male, you have this power. We're gonna jump in on this topic and do what we're supposed to do with it. If you're new to the channel, I'm Boss Money Bates, and this is Expensive Facts. All right, fellas, let's start off like this. There is an energy and a power that you have that all women feel. Yes, that's right, an energy and power that you have that all women feel, and even when they reject you, even when they turn away from you, they cannot help but feel this energy. Let's jump into it. I'm gonna let her tell you. I had this male friend, all right? And I rejected him. Um, we were dating. One time he got really angry at me in like a joking way, all right? And he really let like his masculine power that I always sensed under the surface out. And I got really turned on, but of course I did not tell him that, okay? But if he knew that, and he knew that, you know, he could bring that out more, he could use that against me. So, what is this masculine power? Um, it, it's it's difficult to put, you know, words to it, but it's, it's an energy that all men have that's extremely powerful it's raw it's raw. now you see what she said she said that energy her male friend showed her that energy of dominance that energy where he was just a little bit angry a little rough around the edges women love that women love men to be men this is why i always tell you guys listen you have to be a man you have to be that man you can't let a woman run over you you understand what I'm saying? Because when women run over you, women don't look at you as a man. I told you in a couple of other videos, say when women lose respect for you, there's no more regaining respect for you. You have to keep that malely presence. You have to keep your male instincts there because that is attractive to women. Women love you to be a man. Women love you to be that man. You can be out with her and it's a situation where she feels like she needs to be protected and you protect her, women love to feel protected. They don't like to feel like they're walking around with a weak person that can't protect them. Also by instinct, women want men to take control. You are supposed to lead. So when you lead and you show that you can be a man and be the man that you're supposed to be, women love this quality. Here's this book, Mode One, okay? And it's kind of talking about this. I, I recommend you all read it. And basically, it said if every man took a truth serum and he said exactly what he thought and he did exactly what he wanted and he kind of didn't give a fuck anymore. Um, and he said brutal brutal um yeah brutal i guess raw honesty about girls like you know instead of just being like you're beautiful if what he was really thinking was like oh my god i would love to just like throw you down on this couch and fuck you right now or whatever and it's like kind of raunchy and dirty but that was what he was honestly feeling that is attractive all right if he's angry and he acts angry that is attractive it's this power that men have that's just like maybe like if you're a guy watching this you can understand it from the reverse perspective like are there certain things that women do and you're just like oh my god like I am at your mercy it's the same for girls with now, guys in that clip you heard her say that she would rather mm -hmm. God tell her the truth this is another thing that I tell you guys. See, a lot of you dudes are caught in the wrong way. You're telling women what you think they want to hear. When honestly, the truth will get you more than what the lie gets you. 
Meaning, you don't always have to beat around the bush with a female. Once she's feeling you, she's feeling you. What messes up the moment is when you don't tell her what you're feeling. Yo, listen, I want you right now. This is what I want right now. Now, I'm not telling you to do this in any type of wrong way, fellas. Understand and understand what I'm trying to say to you. What I'm saying to you is this. You being a male, you showing that male dominance. That is the key. That is the energy that females love. Yo, listen, I want you right now. What, for real? You, you know what I mean? I want you right now. I want to touch you in places you ain't been touched before. I need you right now. Let me put these lips on you right now. This is what females are looking for. Females don't want you to be like, <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Beautiful. Uh-huh. Yeah. Oh, man. I can't wait till the next date. Fellas, you can't be doing that. You got to let these females know exactly what it is, but a certain way. They want that male energy. They want that aggressive energy at times. They respect that at times because that's what you are. You are a man. They love that animalistic instinct. Check this out. Almost like if they knew it was there and they knew that I liked it and they knew that I wanted it and they unleashed it or turned it on or suddenly started to bring that out more. It would be dangerous for me because then I would be vulnerable because I would be able to be manipulated and I would be kind of weak, if you know what I mean, because it's so attractive. So it would put me at like disadvantage. So I will never like, I would never point this out to a guy necessarily. I'm just like, you know what, dude, you're on your own. You figure it out because I'm not going to make myself vulnerable to tell you that I still find you attractive and I'm not going to tell you how you could bring it out of yourself. You also heard her say that a lot of men don't know that they have this power. She's saying that that power and that energy <laughs> leave her discombobulated. Like she loves that feeling, but she's not gonna tell you how to make her feel. Fellas, this is why I'm telling you, you have to use that energy and that power for your good. Women don't always like you to be the neat collar dude. This is why, once again, we can go back to my video. This is why the bad guy, quote unquote, the bad guy usually gets the girl and the good guy finishes last. The good guy and the nice guy is always cutting their tongue and curbing what they have to say when the bad guy is saying exactly what it is that's on his mind. It's telling you exactly what it is that he feels. Women want you to tell them what you feel at that moment. You understand what I'm saying? Because if you don't tell them what you feel, then you're going to drop the ball. And once you drop that ball, nine times out of ten, you lost that girl. I myself have rejected a lot of guys, you know, back when I used to date. I rejected a lot of guys for different reasons, okay? Maybe this one was too shy. Um, maybe this guy, he wasn't confident enough. Maybe this guy, I didn't like his looks really that that much. Maybe this guy, he wasn't like, you know, acting cool enough or something. Um, maybe this guy, he was kind of too like, like begging and stuff. And maybe this guy, he wasn't a good kisser. All of that, all of those reasons to reject a guy did not take away from, I still felt each of these guys attractive power ass guys it's like they were doing annoying things and they were doing things which i couldn't accept that my high standards or whatever at the time would not let me accept them for but i didn't think i didn't ever for one second forget that they were still guys when you see that she gave a list of reasons why she didn't want to mm -hmm. mess with the guy but what she also said was, in noticing the reasons that she want, didn't want to mess with this guy, he could have been aggravating, he could have been the weakling type, he could have been anything that aggravated her and didn't meet her standards, but she still felt that raw energy that you have as a man, that power that you have as a man. So fellas, I say that to say this, Knowing that women all feel this power, knowing that women all feel this energy, 
Now you have to know how to use that energy to get to the next step and to stay at the next step. You understand what I'm saying? Use that energy. Dig deep inside of yourself. The first thing that you have to do is have confidence because if you don't have confidence in you, then everything else is not going to work. And this is what this channel is for. I try to give you guys confidence. You have to be confident in yourself. You have to know that you are the prize, that you are that person. You are that dude. And if you have that confidence and you build that confidence up, you can do just about anything. You can get the girl that you want. You can have the life that you want. You can live exactly how you want if you have that confidence and you know how to master that energy master that energy because that energy is the energy that's gonna help you later need i say more i'm boss money bait and this is expensive as expensive could get and that ain't no bullshit Knuckle.